The athletic training room here at Coronado is a place that many call home. Between the countless athletes, the 19 student trainers, and the coaches, it's easy to forget the story of Angel Ariola. And he got registered one day, next day he says, this is my physical here, and I'm like, okay, what for? And he talked about doing tennis, and he had talked about being a soccer manager, and then the next thing we knew, he's a student trainer and he's hanging out with us, so. I try to help all students, someone who have hurting our concern in warrior something to or athletic is on my hurting. He shows a lot more dedication and appreciation towards the program than anybody else. Angel Ariola is part of the special education program and a new addition to the athletic trainers. Angel transferred to Coronado after doing athletic training at Austin High School, where he had met athletic trainer Emilio Arajo, who has developed a strong bond with him. It was at the urban track meet and he came over to help because it was a big track meet and he was just all over the place. He, as soon as anybody would come up and ask for ice, he would get up and do it or whatever they needed, he was ready to do it right there and then. He put them on notice, he put them on their toes. I tried to help him for everywhere to get help right away as possible and I fill all the water all the time for all they needed to stay hydrated all the time. Despite his deafness, Angel has a love of athletic training, and his passion is pushing his fellow student trainers to work hard and better appreciate training. He's just gone home. He asked, what can I do? Can we do this? Or we got to go to here. And it's just funny. He goes, I'm going to work this. I'm going to be here. So now they're kind of starting to step back up and quit being, I'll say it, lazy. It shows the other people who are in that program, the other trainers, that they should appreciate it and be as dedicated or involved as he is. He just kind of reminds you of like the way you first were when you joined the program and how you really wanted to be involved. Angel has not only developed a bond with the trainers, but also with the athletes. For somebody that has the deafness that he had, I didn't notice it until like a few days ago. He likes being near the players, making sure they're okay, if they need water. Some hope the Angel story will encourage more sports teams to integrate kids from the special education program into their programs. Even if they have special needs or extra help or slow down or whatever, that's fine. That, that even gives us a new perspective and something to work on ourselves. Whether it be autism, whatever it is, and it gets them a chance to feel like they're like any other student in school. Angel Ariola reminds us all that if we care about something, we can't let anything stop us. This is Rachel Coleman reporting for CTV, and back to you.